Key Experience Platform and Inovia, you can eliminate errors in your bill of materials, avoiding unnecessary development costs and delays. Your designers interact with the product engineer through a bill of material. With file-based collaboration, each group of discipline-specific designers create a product structure in CAD that produces an engineering bill of materials, often as a file or spreadsheet. The product engineer needs to aggregate this information and keep a spreadsheet or specialized BOM system updated. When the product structure changes, your product engineer must then make manual corrections to the BOM. They may also add non-CAD-related items, such as lubricants, that are not reflected in the CAD model. The manual modifications lead to repeated bomb errors and mismatch problems. The time finding and correcting bomb mismatches significantly impacts your development cycle time and product quality. This leads to problems such as no early visibility, data entry errors, enterprise lack of access to this information, bomb disconnects from design, difficult to make changes, very error prone, and time consuming. The problem of BOM and CAD mismatch between the product structure and EBOM goes away with the ANOVIA data-driven approach, where the designer's data and the engineering BOM data are connected through the platform. When a designer makes a change to the product structure, the change is propagated and reflected in the EBOM with no manual effort or file exchanges. And when the engineer updates the EBOM, the change is propagated to the standard product structure, allowing the designer to make revisions as needed. The BOM serves as a single version of the truth for engineering and other enterprise business process planning information, providing an always up-to-date and accurate source of product information. The EBOM and related design information can be extracted as files for integration with other file-based processes. Multiple design and BOM configurations can be effectively managed, allowing you to control design variations and achieve simultaneous product launches. Inovia also provides integrations to ERP systems for manufacturing and dependent business processes. With a data-driven approach, you remove barriers between organizations, eliminate CAD bomb mismatch due to manual data entry, and drive out errors in your process. This video is a good example of the unique Inovia fully connected design and bomb approach. At any time, the designer can update their design and, with a single button click, update and fully connect the corresponding bill of material. The CAD structure is published in a neutral geometric format, which is visualized and analyzed by the included DS 3D visualization tool, 3D Examine. The user can interact with the fully connected CAD and BOM structure to visualize and validate both design and business process planning information at the same time. The user can view the BOM and interact with the design using the new graphical structure browser or a more traditional indented BOM table format. Here you're seeing the new graphical structure browser and now we switch to the more traditional indented table view. And as you can see, as you select um, parts in the Bill of material, the corresponding information highlights in the 3D view. You can further interrogate um, details um, at lower levels in the bill of material, as you see here, the flywheel in this lawnmower engine example. 
Other fully connected design and bomb reports are available, such as showing a bomb comparison with a corresponding 3D view, or an affected item list for a change process with a corresponding 3D view. The combination of fully connected design and bomb views, coupled with the included 3D viewer, is unique to the Anovia bomb solution. Other significant business value that the Inovia Bomb Management Solution offers is to serve as a consolidated business process planning hub. All enterprise stakeholders can connect their business process specific documentation and attributes to plan and orchestrate the transition from design to production. Engineering Bomb dashboard views are provided which summarize the maturity of all the parts in an e-bomb. The latest Inovia offerings have transitioned to role-based licensing. The role associated to engineering bomb management is product engineer. The product engineer role includes all the functionality to collaborate with design, manage engineering bill of materials, and detailed enter enterprise parts and author and fully participate in related engineering change processes. Endurance Technologies is a great Innovia bomb mid-market customer, realizing the benefits of zero bomb errors. This slide summarizes the key benefits the Inovia Bomb Solution brings to our customers in achieving zero bomb errors, resulting in higher profit margins, lower development costs, and reduced time to market. We will now discuss some advanced bomb management topics. The Inovia Global Product Development Bill of Material Solution goes beyond engineering bomb management and offers even more business value to customers by providing the capability to plan and define site-specific manufacturing bill of materials and part characteristics, such as make-buy, authorization of the use of alternate and substitute parts, and site-specific manufacturing parts, such as raw materials and manufacturing kits. In addition, the Inovia Manufacturing Bomb Solution includes a fully connected and highly automated manufacturing change process, which eliminates the time-consuming and error-prone manual effort of implementing and validating engineering changes in the impacted manufacturing sites. If a company releases an e-bomb without considering how each manufacturing site handles inventory shortages and local supply chain constraints, two negative outcomes can occur. One, the manufacturing site may unwillingly use a part that does not fulfill the form, fit, and function of the original design intent. This can lead to recalls, poor customer acceptance, etc. Second, it becomes difficult for purchasing to reduce costs due to scale. If each site is making its own part decisions without central coordination, it becomes nearly impossible for purchasing to aggregate their spend. The solution is to move the definition of site-specific alternates and supplier equivalents to the EBOM specification itself. This means engineers and designers are involved as much as manufacturing engineers and purchasing agents. For each part in EBOM that the company makes, Engineers also define other part numbers that manufacturing can either substitute regardless of use or for specific usage scenarios. For those parts provided by suppliers, a list of all the supplier part numbers that provide the same fit, form, and function is defined from a central perspective. Manufacturing sites are defined for end items, which are significant assemblies produced at one or more sites. The EBOM common view that you see here in this video is used to define alternate or substitute parts, which can be 
other enterprise parts or qualified supplier parts. A site filter is applied in the EBOM common view to manage the plant-specific authorization and usage of alternate and substitute parts. So this provides a centralized planning function and authorization for each of the sites if there's more than one alternate or substitute part to find, to uh, define the specific ones that that site should use. Centralized alternate and substitute manufacturing planning provides centralized control and reuse while still providing the manufacturing sites local flexibility. Further benefits occur if the site-specific MBOMs are also managed in ANOVIA. In this case, the EBOM is also directly traceable to exactly what manufacturing tends to do at each site. The solution is to allow each site to define its own MBOM structures in the same system as the EBOM. However, this does not mean using separate structures. Each site-specific MBOM directly references parts in the EBOM as possible, while still allowing for different structuring between the sites. For instance, notice how the two views of the MBOM in the lower diagram are directly referencing different parts in the EBOM. This can be done with confidence because we know that engineering has approved which, man which parts manufacturing can select when the EBOM was released, and the EBOM and the MBOMs are interrelated to facilitate cross-functional reviews. When the EBOM is released, site-specific MBOMs or MBOM changes with site-specific manufacturing change order processes are created automatically. Users can filter on any of these site-specific MBOM views and add content, such as raw materials or manufacturing phantom parts, which are used to group EBOM parts into manufacturing kits. The user can specify a start date on manufacturing change orders independently for each site, which allows flexibility to implement the change into ERP um, when based on inventory constraints and, and other factors. Other capabilities that can be done at a site-specific level, parts can be changed from make to buy or buy to make. Alternate, authorized alternate or substitute parts can be instantiated into the site-specific MBOM. Changes can be bypassed for certain plants. Plants can be made inactive. So there are a lot of advanced capabilities to uh, have complete control over these site-specific MBOMs and MBOM changes. In summary, the Inovia Manufacturing Bomb Manager role extends the benefits of zero error engineering bombs into manufacturing. Key benefits include one version of the truth for engineering and all site-specific manufacturing views, increased product innovation, improved and faster decision-making, zero engineering and manufacturing bomb errors, and productivity and cost optimization. <laughs>